Listen up, people. I'm looking for a driver. If you can handle yourself on the water, and in the air, and behind the wheel, obviously, though we'll come to that later, then maybe you've got what my team needs. Beat the posted time for the trial, and there'll be a spot for you. Fail, and well, I'm sure someone else will grab the opportunity. Alexis Kendrick Racing deals strictly with winners. And I'm Alexis, so I would know. Congratulations, you got the gig. Let's go someplace we can talk about what happens next. That wasn't half bad. I'm looking forward to having you on the team. There's still some things you need to work on, but that's okay. I'll teach you what you need to know. It'll be hard work, but you'll see the results on the track, or the waves, or in the air. So, this is the pit. It's where the pro racing community preps. Now you can hang out here too. You belong. That's Clarence Bishop, the third. He's the reigning champ around here. Racing royalty, really. His father and grandfather were both champions, too. Which helps explain his attitude. If you start winning, he won't be happy with you. Clarence is old school. Doesn't think anything needs to change. A lot of drivers see things differently. Me, I think there needs to be some balance. You'll decide for yourself, I guess. Just in case you're wondering, there's a powerboat with your name on it waiting for you in the shop. Don't thank me. You've earned it. And you're gonna need it. The rest of these, you can buy later. <laughs> Not that one, little grasshopper. Not yet. You need to find the winner's circle a few times first. In case you hadn't noticed, now we can edit videos through the live app. Just open the map, search through it, and you'll find the tools you need. I'll bet posting those babies gets us tons of new followers.
know I'm not usually the one saying this sort of thing, but are you sure about this race? And I'm not the one who usually says you're worrying too much. But here we are. It's all set. Between this and the race in Vegas, we're showing off the new venues. So we're hoping the big jump means big numbers? That's the idea. It's a big chance we're taking trying a location like this, but we've got to do it. One thing will never change, though. Old-fashioned driving will always win. Three, two, one. No risk, no reward. I guess that's one way of looking at it. You've got to evolve to stay relevant. If that means trying new venues, from downtown to 10 miles east of the middle of nowhere, then maybe that's what we got to do. But I know it's a gamble. It won't do us any good to win new fans if we lose the old ones. Finding a balance, that's the tricky part. Racing on the ocean's not like racing on rivers and lakes. You've got to fight the waves, but if you learn to use them, they can be your friend. Then you can ride them to victory.
okay? I must have tuned the boat wrong. 